So what's the verdict, Doc? You're coming along fine. But I want you to stay in bed a little while longer. Can you give me that in days? Uh, in a day or two. Oh, great. That's what I love about you. You're so specific. <laughs> oh, hi, Tony. Hi. I didn't know you were here. Well, that's all right. I'll just come back later. No, stay. I'm finished. I like this comfort coming and going in shifts. Do you ever stop? How are we going to put up with him for another couple of days? I don't know. You okay? Yeah, fine. Well, I've got to get going. Okay. Uh, Tony, uh, could you do me a little favor? Oh, brother. Okay, what is it this time? No, this is serious. Could you drive my car from the garage to the mission parking area? Why? Don't you want to leave it downstairs to be a... Well, I, I promised a friend that he could borrow it. I don't want him bothering the cab wheels. He's, he's kind of weird. He's a mechanic. He's going to help me fix it. Well, sure, I'll do it. Of course, someone's going to have to follow me in my car. Kelly, would you mind uh, driving Tony's car, following mine? Um, well, I don't know if... Yeah, sure. Okay, well, you mind if we do it right away? I've got errands. No, that's fine. Okay. Listen, I'll, I'll be down in just a minute, okay? Okay. Bye. Thanks. You look like a bomb about to go off. Cruz, you gotta help me. Name it. You have to persuade Joe to get out of town. It's too much for me. I just, I can't deal with it. All my loyalties are getting mixed up. Maybe that's not such a bad thing. It says a lot about how you feel for Joe. <laughs> 